Yo, what's up, people? This your boy E from Cut With E. So, I know that my channel is a haircutting tutorial, but I'm gonna also take you guys on my weight loss journey. You know, because weight is something I've been battling with all my life. You know what I'm saying? I, I hold weight in my midsection. I mean, gut galore. You know what I'm saying? From neck down, from neck to waist. But from waist down, I look like I play in the NFL. <laughs> So this Monday, I started keto. And of course y'all, well, YouTube don't know, but on my TikTok you would know that um, uh, two weeks ago I fasted. And I did uh, five days out. My last meal was at two o'clock that Sunday. And I didn't eat until Saturday morning for breakfast. And I lost a total of 14 pounds uh, doing that. So all I did was drunk water. I had no food for that whole week. Uh, I drank water, and every now and then, I would put a little Pedialyte in my water to replenish myself, electrolytes and whatnot, because I was still doing uh, three miles of cardio every day. I would go to the track and jog and walk three miles total. So uh, this weight loss, man, I'm going to tell you something. There's a few people that has eating themselves into obesity. But for the majority of us, it's a DNA thing. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't eat that bad. I ain't gonna lie. I don't eat, I don't really eat that bad at all. And everything I eat sticks stick with me, you know? I mean, I can grab a cookbook and look at the pictures in the cookbook and gain a pound. <laughs> so uh, I'm trying to reverse that. Uh, you know, I've been fighting it for a long time. So it's time I do something about it uh, and be serious, take it for real. But uh, so I started keto this past Monday and I was at 206 this past Monday. I should have documented it from day one, but I didn't. And today is, is Wednesday. So today I'm 200 pounds. So I, I've lost six pounds since uh, since uh, Monday morning. But I'm going to show you guys what I do every morning. So here's the ingredients for my shake every morning. Okay, I put uh, two tablespoons of uh, coconut oil in it, eight ounces of uh, almond milk, and uh, a tablespoon of a uh, heavy whipping cream. When I first did it the first day, I like messed myself around because I. I did it all together, man. You know, I I, I drunk my milk, sh my uh my protein shake with, uh with my eggs, two eggs, and uh, bacon, two pieces of bacon. And here's what I use. I use turkey bacon instead of a. Uh, pork bacon you know it's always better for you so I put my turkey bacon I'm gonna put two pieces in my air fryer right here so I'm gonna cook this up here in a minute and uh and then after that a couple hours after that about 12 o'clock I'm gonna eat some almonds I have to eat two ounces of almonds and I'm going to uh going to show you that but I went and bought me a scale this past uh Sunday night to prepare for Monday morning and uh, it's just you want to know your ounces and your and your grams so the grams I have to put 20 grams of protein in that milk so it's 20 grams of this and then the rest you know ounces and whatnot but I get that I document my meals through the day and whatnot and really today is just going to be a life in the day of E. I start my day out about 6.30, 7 o'clock. And then I'm going to eventually show you guys uh, ways that I make money as well. I talked about that in other shows. Uh, you may not know, but uh, I'm a day trader as well. I have uh, some losing trades going right now as well as some positive trades. 
But as long as you don't press sell, you never lose your money. That's the key to winning. I'm trying to tell you. So then um, I'm going to show you this house that I'm looking to go purchase as well. I'm, I'm actually, I put my earnest money on it on Monday. So I'm under contract to buy that. And I'm going to show you that. And then I'll be going to my shop and cutting some hair. Uh, actually, like in about an hour and a half. I got three heads lined up. So let's get to it, man. We got to get the day going, baby. We got a lot of money to be made. You know what I'm saying? I grew up in the great state of Mississippi. But all my people from New Orleans, my mama, my brother stayed down there, all my all my relatives, all my daddy from Louisiana, everybody from down there, you know what I'm saying? So we got this this hot bug in us, you know what I'm saying? We we love spices, you know what I'm talking about? Uh, that's how I ate growing up. You gotta try something, gotta try to make it good, man. If you don't, you'll be right here. Uh, get falling off your diet, you know man, make it make it taste good, you know, try to make it work for you. Meanwhile, we still got our bacon going over here. I gotta keep taming my beard down, man. Y'all got me looking all scraggly on, on the boob tube, as we used to say when we was kids, the boob tube. You know, I figure I have to be a little bit more proactive with my uh, YouTube channel. I just let my partner do it all, man. I don't know nothing about none of this stuff. That's that's the main reason that I'm not proactive, because I don't know nothing. To be proactive, we're on with it, you know? So, I'm starting to uh, take a more proactive stance with this here thing. Uh, I brought my scale down here to show y'all what I weighed, but it's too late. I, I, uh, I already dropped my shake this morning. I, I weighed in 200. I weighed myself on an empty stomach in the morning. That's your true morning weight, not after you ate breakfast. So, then one more thing, people, that I do. But this is the must right here. Yeah, a gallon of water a day. Because when you're on these type of diets, they will dehydrate you. Which is why I was putting a little Pedialyte in uh in in my water when I was fasting. And trust me, I didn't know that I could fast. I never did nothing like that before in my life. That was absolutely insane. Somebody tell me, "Oh, you can fast." I can't fast. Man, why wouldn't I want to eat? But I did it. And you know, it proved I proved something to myself. This is weight loss journey, man. You have to change your mindset. You gotta really prove stuff to yourself that you can push your body to a limit that you didn't know you can push it to you know because losing weight ain't easy it's not easy at all especially when you have our body type that's that's just prone to picking up weight I mean over the weekend I gained four or five pounds just and I'm eating like everybody else mm. so my bacon stop Pretty good. I see. That's good enough. People, get your air fryer if you don't have one. That thing that saved a whole life, a lot of time, everything, bro. Okay, let's eat. 